Howdy folks, Daniel Rubino here with Windows Phone Central. I just want to give you guys a quick look here at Instagraph, the first unofficial Instagram client coming for Windows Phone 8, due in the store hopefully in the next few days to maybe a week. The app is made by Vanetasoft, who also makes Turbo Camera and a few security apps for Windows Phone that are highly rated. The app itself is pretty solid. Um, it's a native client here that has access to the Instagram network. And it's basically just meant to post photos, so you can't browse or check out your followers. For that, you might want to use Metrogram or the other uh, half dozen apps that are out there. Anyway, you load up the app here, and then you can go and you pick a photo that you want. You can also, of course, load up the camera module and just take a photo directly if you want. Uh, it launches you next into the Avery Photo Editor, which is pretty familiar to most of you. It's found in quite a few apps. Uh, we can go through and add a filter if you want to make it kind of hipster-ish that's a nice bold one <laughs> and then you can go through like i said you can crop it add stickers all that kind of stuff so this is actually more full feature than typical instagram right uh and then you go through add a comment let's see if i can type this here and then you hit send Public confirmation, share this picture on Instagram, you get the notification, yes. And now the idea here is it's going to their servers. So this is how the app works. Uh, they do not have access to Instagram's APIs. Instead, what they're doing is uh, it is going through their Azure server which then connects up to Instagram for you and then posts the photo. It's a real clever method. Uh, it's definitely a kludge, but it works. And, you know, we don't have any other solutions right now. So this is just basically telling you uh, the photo is queued up and you can actually see it there. Estimated time, one minute. And it's true, it's between one minute and five minutes, the photo will get posted automatically. Now, I don't need to leave the app open. I can you know, minimize the app and get out of this and it'll just go. It's already on the server, their server, just waiting to be uploaded. This is merely just verifying that status. So that is pretty cool. Now they are, will be adjusting their server, um, you know, scaling it appropriately based on the amount of traffic they're getting here. So there could be some growing pains initially, but otherwise that is basically how it works. I, my previous photo you'll see is posted there still and you can see it was verified that's up there tapping it just goes to the web page for my instagram account and so i can sort of um you know follow things and use it that way but there's no way to actually go through this app and integrate or uh, interact with that photo now because all this does like i said is for posting photos directly to instagram and because of that it actually works well um not many other options. You have your Instagram account, your settings here, app save, auto save pictures. So anytime you modify a photo, it'll automatically be saved. Don't show message boxes and reset accounts. And you have your Instagram page in terms of conditions. So other than that, there's not too much to it. If you go into photos, we'll go into our camera roll here. You can see I can choose that bottle again. Now what's kind of neat about this is they did get access to the edit function. So if you go into edit here, you'll see Instagraph is listed uh, right next to Creative Studio and Crop Auto Rotate Fix. That's the built-in Windows Phone editing tools. So that's kind of cool they got access to that because obviously that makes it very high profile. So now I can just open this photo directly into Instagraph, quickly manipulate my photo, hit a button, and it will be published to the Instagram account. So that is a quick tour of Instagram. It works 100%. This was not an April Fool's joke, and we're confident it will make it through the Windows Phone store. So just pay attention to Windows Phone Central, where we'll bring you more information on this app. Take care, everybody.